everyone welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you're all well a slightly different video today hence this setup i know that most of you are here for the fashion and the styling videos but this video is actually going to be the second part of my teeth straightening process so i just wanted to give a little update as it's been a little while now since i filmed my first video just for those of you maybe who haven't seen the first video i'll leave a link to it in the description box of this video in case you want to go and watch it um, maybe you want to watch that first or to be fair, it doesn't really matter which order you watch them in that much. Just to update you, I'm in the process of straightening my teeth with invisible aligners and I'm doing this with Smile Kit, as you will be able to see from the title of the video. Just a little side note, I'm currently wearing my invisible aligners, so if you can hear a little change in my voice or a slight lisp, then that is why. I'm still getting used to them. I've had them in for a few days now, but it has taken some adjusting, so... I still catch myself lisping every so often, so I just want to make note of that. This treatment has kindly been gifted to me by Smile Kit, but I'm not being paid to make these videos. Um, I just thought it would be a good idea to um, keep you guys updated with the process, and if anyone has any questions or wants to sort of see how this treatment works, I just thought this would be a good way to document it. I also thought it would be really good for me as well to see um, a clearer before and after so um, obviously I will be showing you that at the end of the treatment. But right now I have my lines in. The first video I filmed was me taking my impressions and since then my aligners have arrived. So this is the first tray of my aligners. I started wearing them on Monday. It's now Thursday when I'm filming this. So I've only had them in for a few days, but I just wanted to make this video to show you guys the aligners, what I got in the kit and just explain the process up to now as I'm on to the next stage of it. So as I said, I put this first tray in on Monday. I actually put it in in the evening just before I went to sleep um, because I thought if there was any major movement in my teeth, then um, I, it would be when I was sleeping. So I would feel the uncomfortableness, um, the discomfort a little bit less. And that worked quite well for me. I've never worn a retainer before or had braces or anything like that. Um, I'd never even really had impressions done before. So this whole thing is really foreign to me. And obviously putting in the tray was a little bit strange. I've never experienced anything like that before. And Tuesday when I woke up, it was a little bit uncomfortable, not really pain, just like a slight ache in my teeth. Like if you've experienced um, grinding your teeth when you're sleeping, um, it sort of felt a little bit like that ache. But yesterday, Wednesday, the second full day of wearing them, it was absolutely fine, no real discomfort at all. The main thing for me was just getting used to the fact that the tray was there. I was very aware that they were in my mouth um, constantly, really but now I'm really used to it and yeah, it just took a couple of days for me to adjust. So when I'm wearing the aligners, I keep them in all day apart from when I am eating. Um, so you're allowed to drink water whilst you've got them in, but nothing else really. So it has really upped my water intake because I've just been drinking water throughout the day and like no fizzy drinks really or alcohol. So it has helped me in that way and it has helped me with snacking less as well because obviously I have to remove the retainers to eat and I only really have done that at meal times now because I just can't be bothered to take the retainers out, wash them. I like to brush my teeth as well before I put them back in. So yeah, it has helped me with that. Now, this is the box that my um, aligners came in. They came very, very organized. So they come in these little sealed packets. This is the first one, so obviously there's nothing in there. Now my upper teeth, I have 17 trays and my lower teeth I have 12 so slightly less for the bottom set of teeth and each tray has to be changed every two weeks so I think my treatment will be completely finished around August time so it's quite a way away but the change will be good so I just have to persevere with it and it will be worth it in the end. I might just show you actually the end trays I don't know how well you will be able to see this. This is the tray for my upper teeth. You probably can't see it very well, but um, it's super straight. So this is what I'm gonna get to at the end of August. So I'm pretty excited about that. Also in that box came a teeth whitening kit, which I actually used for the first time last night. Oh God. Um, I've never used any sort of teeth whitening um, before. So I'm really excited to see the results from this one. I'll just take it out quickly to explain how to use it. So it comes with these pens. As you can see, there's three of them. And what you do is just brush this gel onto your teeth and then use the ultraviolet light, which actually just plugs into your phone. And you just sit with that in your mouth for 16 minutes. And it says for best results to repeat for 10 days. 
I think it says that. I'm sure I read that. It says repeat this each day for 10 days for optimum results. So I'm gonna give that a go and see what difference it makes. The teeth whitening kit also comes with this little color guide so you can measure where you were at and then you can see the after effects as well. I was about a four or five on this scale, so around here. So I'm excited to see um, the results from this. The next thing that I briefly wanted to explain is the um, IPR. So in the kit, I got this little sheet here and IPR, basically the way that I see it is like flossing. Um, you, get, you get these little tools here, which there's three of them and you basically just use them to floss. And Smile Kit have given me a guide of which teeth I need to do it on. And uh, most people need to do it once a week, but I have to do it twice a week. So it's basically just gliding the tool in between your teeth. It says to slide it minimum four times between each tooth. So that doesn't take too long. I just do that after I brush my teeth twice a week. So it's quite a lot to remember. I have had to put it all in a calendar to know when to change my aligner, to do my whitening and to do my IPR as well. Also with my aligners came this little toolkit, which just comes with a few things if you need to um, slightly file down or trim your aligners if they're not exactly the right shape. But mine were absolutely perfect. They fitted my mouth really, really comfortably. So I didn't have any issues with that. Also comes with little cases for your aligners as well to put them in when you take them out. If you're out somewhere eating, I haven't been out for food or out for drinks yet. So that might be quite interesting. I guess I'll just go to the bathroom of wherever I am and remove them and then pop them back in. But yeah, that's pretty much everything I wanted to share. So obviously I'm still right at the beginning of my treatment. I haven't really seen much difference yet because this is only the first up 17 and 12 trays. So I'm probably gonna film another update video when I'm around halfway through my treatment, just so I can update you guys on how I'm getting on with the aligners, if I've had any issues, any discomfort, and let you know my progress and if I'm pleased with it, which, which judging by the aligners and the shape of them, um, hopefully I will be because I'm really excited to have some straight teeth finally. <laughs> Obviously you will still be able to see differences and updates in my other videos and probably vlogs mainly um, as the treatment progresses. But yeah, this was just a quick little update video for you to let you know how I'm getting on with the treatment because I know when I filmed my first one, quite a few of you were actually interested in the process. So hopefully these are helpful for you. But yeah, I will keep you updated in other videos, mainly vlogs, uh, but my next update video on my teeth will probably be around April time. Um, so I will give you a proper update and maybe show some before and afters then. But if anyone does have any questions, please leave them in the comments or you can email SmileKit directly because their customer service is great. So you can do that if you're interested in the process. But yeah, normal fashion content will resume after this video. But yeah, I hope that this was useful for you guys. If it was, please give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any future updates. And I will see you on Wednesday with another video.